Welcome back to Wonderful Stays Home Tours. My name is Brian. And I'm Hong. We're here in Mountain View, California, taking a look at the Malfi community by D.R. Horton. We're going to take a look at their residence three. It is a two bedroom, two and a half bath, 1,120 square feet with a starting price of $1,101,000 and an HOA of $367 per month. If you're interested in real estate, looking for homes in Mountain View, or just need more interior design ideas, come on this tour with us. Let's go. That's fine. Plenty. It's smaller. All right. This is nice. I mean, this part, that is. You know what I like? Yeah, I am. No. This is pretty cool. Especially when you just walk down. Ah, uh, the garage is closed. Let's see. Stairway. Oh, whoa. The carpet is really nice still, huh? Yeah. Here's your view. Oh. oh. I don't like this at all. You don't like it? Yeah, it feels so small. It does feel small. This is what, nine? No, it, no, it's not 900. Never mind. Oh. Look at the kitchen. A living room space. That's kind of interesting, right? You sit here and you have the TV and your living space right here. Interesting, huh? At least you have it in... Was that you? Huh. You have a little study area there. Washer and dryer goes here just in case you didn't know that. There's a sign and nice storage space. Oh, they made the under the stairs part of the house a little storage space. Or a little washer and dryer. That's an actual smart idea. Kitchen, nice kitchen, pretty roomy. Here's the view of the park, uh, of the park, and some apartments. Nice island. Uh, you can sit one, two, three, and here's your dog. Eating area too. Pretty cool. Pretty nice. Your living space. This is a good idea, the study space. Roof access, door open. Are you accessing the roof? Yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool. Here's your powder. Really, really tight. It's extremely tight. Wow. You can barely walk around in here. Interesting. So here's your living, dining. I guess there's no dining except for the island. I guess the island is the dining spot, huh? That's the only way. Yeah. You, were you able to go up the roof? No, right? Yeah. Shut up. Really? Yeah. You'll see. Don't worry. This is nice. Uh, this is not really. What is this? The, the master? master? Yeah. Pretty small, huh? That's exactly what she said. To you? No, she never said that to me. Yeah, she's like, oh, it's really dog friendly, huh? It's pretty small. <laughs> Nice view of the power cables. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, tennis court. That's a big park. 
a private German Chinese school. <clears throat> Whoa, so small, huh? Yep. Interesting. And you said this is the master? Yep. The smallest master ever, huh? <laughs> it's like downstairs, but just upgrade it. Nice tiles, though. Nice tiles. Hmm. <laughs> okay. And here's your walk-in closet. Something you like. Yeah, walk in. No. But never come out of the closet. No, I'm talking about the mirror. Oh, yeah. yes. Oh, oh, yes, yes. The mirror is nice. I actually like that. It's a nice idea. Ever since she pointed it out, it's actually really nice. Nice dresser. Or nice stands. This is you also pretty set nice. Yourself up I know, I did, I did. I definitely did. Very good. Not yet, not yet. Not yet? Let's do this. Okay. This is not too bad of a size, right? Bedroom. Okay. We have a the Juliet balcony. The Romeo and Juliet? Yeah. Kinda like the one we saw in um in a locale. Yeah. Actually, you can put plants. This one, this one is cool. Oh, because they blocked it. Yeah. Nice view. You can put plants. And there's um, grill so that way you can let the leakage go through. Or if you overwater it. Interesting. The kid's bathroom, or whoever's bathroom is this. It's bigger than the master? Yeah. <laughs> you got to be kidding me. Because it has a tub. Yeah. Yeah, no, I see that. I see that. It's more spacious. Yeah. Slightly. Yeah. Slightly. Interesting, huh? This, um... This is way closer to what you actually get, all right? The plain white. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of apartments around here. Here's Brian. <laughs> well, this is a interesting idea. A little vent system. Oh, what the? Yeah. Okay, so this is the selling point, I guess, right? It has to be. <laughs> Why, you? I mean, besides the park. Yeah. Woo! Beautiful. Wow. Interesting. Dog stuff right next to the. AC unit. There's a lot of fur is gonna go in there, huh? Really like a little barbecue area. This is kind of like the metro crossing, huh? A little bit. Interesting. But I'm thinking metro crossing. Yeah. Nice. Pretty cool. It's a nice little area to have, huh? If you like the outdoors. I guess this is better than regular balcony, right? <laughs> this is like the ultimate balcony. Yeah, this is the ultimate. I guess this is what he was talking about. Yeah. I like it. I like this. Yeah, it's really a single. Or yeah. A couple that's one kid? Yeah. And you work for Google, right? Alright. I like this door too, so transparent. 
and that makes sense. Well, I can't lock it now. Oh. Yeah. The masters. This is a cozy home. All right, Brian, what do you think of this home? So this home provides you with a cool deck on the very top floor of the home. It has a lot of space, so you could put a table up there and a barbecue grill if you want. And what they did as an interior design idea, they put a, a small doghouse up there. The only thing I have a drawback is there's that air conditioning unit that's exposed upstairs. But all in all, it's great up there, and it also has a great view as well. An interior design idea that caught our eyes was that next to the powder room there's a desk that's an actual nice use of space if you have a little nook you can put a desk there to study or do work at so what threw me off about this home is that it feels kind of small there's a small living space area and i guess the only thing that makes up for the small space is having that deck upstairs hope you enjoyed the tour of residence three we're going to take a look at residence two on saturday if you like the video don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel Channel. And if you have any comments about the home, let us know in the comments down below. Like, how does the living space feel to you? Have a great day. See you again on Saturday.